turns out to the radio oh, oh, oh. All of the things we're taking Cause we are young and we're the same I don't think I'll beat the rain. I think I'm gonna get caught out. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back. I thought I'd do another day in the life. Today is Sunday and it's a nice chill day. We have got a lot of rain forecast, so I'm trying to get through the boys really quickly. And then this afternoon, I have some exciting things to show you. You would have already seen what that is, but I am very excited. So this morning, I'm just gonna get through the boys as quickly as I can. Obviously, I've got Splash in with me. I don't have a whole heap of hope that I'm gonna be able to get through both of them, but we'll see how we go. So, what's been going on? What has been happening in the boring life of Tabitha? Well, I'm glad you asked. Not a whole heap, to be honest. The boys have been quietly ticking over. Uni's been good. I love my course, holy moly. What else has been happening? Oh, I posted a TikTok last week and it kind of did quite well. Like it didn't blow up, but it did well enough. I went from having just over 6,000 followers on TikTok to now having 10.9k on TikTok which is a little bit scary and a little bit daunting but I'm such an influencer I've just come out and we're just walking around the arena setting up some stuff that we can do and we've got a little bit of a disaster going on. Some mama birds lost her babies. Oh no. This one's got a crack in it. It's probably not viable, hey. I think they're gone. RIP. I'm on the beast. He is being very sensitive today, which is making my job a little bit challenging. And I, like in myself, I feel that I'm quite stiff and quite tense, which isn't really helping the situation. And so with Splash, when he gets worked up, he'll shoot forward and he'll hollow through his back and just kind of go all unique and gross. And so I've just been working on doing 10 meter circles, 20 meter circles, three loop serpentines, leg yielding, and then out of the 10 meter circles, I will pop him into some shoulder in to try and get his mind off stuff because he is very tense. Even just walking down there, like his back's gone up. He doesn't do anything like naughty with it. He's just like, just gets stressed and just gets like really tense and it's not so fun. Yeah, that's how this ride's been going. I mean, like when he's in this sort of mindset, I've got to be aware of what I'm doing and like if my body's making the situation worse, so if he goes to shoot off, like, my instinct is to grab for his mouth and to stop him. Would you stop? But that isn't going to help the situation, so I've just got to, like, sit, not react, and then just get his attention back onto me, otherwise he'll get more tense. So I'm going to pop him down the trotting poles. I might get some footage of that. I was going to go around the jumps. They aren't very high, but I think that's kind of counterintuitive. And also his feet need doing, and I don't want him to pull a shoe. And his toes are a bit long. They're not, like, bad, but they're just, like, not how I like his feet to be. So I'll pop him over the trotting poles, which are just over there. Okay, I'm going to put my phone down somewhere. I think maybe on the tires. Splash is like, what are you doing? We shall try this tiny little rub. I don't 
know if you can see, but it's now raining. It doesn't look like it's raining a lot, but it's like a really wetting rain. My saddle is so wet. Um, yeah, he did that. It's really tiny. He did that better than um, the flight work, which I should have expected. Yeah, but I think it's time to go in before it gets any worse. I'm so proud of you. He's so good. He's so good. He's such a good confidence builder, even though he can be a bit of a challenging ride um, with his sensitivity. He's never done anything dirty. It's just, he's a little bit sensitive. And like, he didn't like the fact that he could hear my phone in my pocket every now and then like hitting the saddle so i had to take it out and put it in my bra but you know mm. can you see the water droplets on my helmet you're such a good boy yeah you're such a good boy my saddle is definitely gonna need a clean look how wet it is oh no i know what i'll be doing after lunch Can you hear the rain? It sounds so nice. So I bought an iPad, I'm still trying to process how exactly I got to the point of buying an iPad. It was kind of impulsive but I've kind of been thinking about it for a good couple of months now. I was looking at them the other day and I realised there was a sale on which probably definitely influenced my decision. I was really not quite sure about it all and I asked on my Instagram what people's thoughts and opinions were having them for uni because that's going to be predominantly what I'm going to use it for. The responses were quite varied. had a number of like people that absolutely loved their iPad and then I had the odd uh, response that wasn't in favour of the iPad and that did make its way into my pros and cons list but I kind of yeah kind of just ended up buying one probably to distract from my problems but I'm very happy with my purchase so far even though I've owned it for less than 24 hours so I got the iPad Air in rose gold it's 10.9 inches and I also got a second generation uh, Apple Pencil. I see a lot of people at uni um, use tablets or iPads and their notes are like so nice, like so aesthetic. And I'm a big visual person. I have almost kind of like photographic memory so the way that I do study and write my notes is really important and I love using colour because it helps me remember stuff. But I kind of just felt like I wanted to try something different and I've heard really good things about it and I've also heard not so great things about it. So I guess I'm just going to try it out and see how it goes. So far the only apps that I've downloaded on it are Pinterest, YouTube, GoodNotes and Procreate. Thinking that I'll keep this iPad mainly for like uni work and making YouTube thumbnails. So I don't have any plans of downloading like social media onto it. But I'll let you know how that goes. And also because of the response on my Instagram, a lot of people were asking if I could share the responses of what other people said. I thought if it would be something that you're interested in, let me know if you want me to make a video on if I find the iPad for uni work helpful at all. It will be an honest video. I'm not going to recommend something to you guys if I don't like it and I'm still keeping a very open mind to the fact that I might not actually like the iPad. Shock horror. We'll just see how it goes. So if that is something that you want to see, let me know and I can incorporate it into a horsey video somehow. Awesome. I've decided to have my lock screen kind of aesthetic and like motivating. So I've got it as a picture of New York. Oh, I really want to go to New York. 
And then my home screen is a random collage that I found on Pinterest. Another reason why I kind of impulsively bought one is because I have exams coming up and I need some sort of motivation to get me to study and using an iPad and using good notes seem like a really good way to motivate me. <laughs> yeah, but if you are in New Zealand and you are looking at buying one, Noel Leeming is having a sale on at the moment. I think it ends the 9th of October. I will say though, the iPad will definitely not replace my MacBook Pro. I type all my essays on my MacBook. I read journal articles and, and obviously I edit on my laptop so I definitely won't be swapping to the iPad for that and I have to say I prefer watching Netflix on my laptop than any other device so that will not be swapping over to the iPad. I'm trying to keep all my social media apps as in like TikTok, Instagram um, on my phone so they won't be on my iPad but in the response thing on my Instagram people did say that they really liked having their social media on the iPad. I guess that's all down to personal preference though. But yeah that's all I kind of have for this video. It's kind of a weird one but I hope you guys have a lovely week and I will see you in the next video very soon. If you have any video requests please comment them down below. I need all the ideas. <laughs>